they, they told me I had to give a speech, and I said, well, that's no good because I don't like to talk. Anybody that knows me will say that. <laughs> Not very good at public speaking, so I'll do my best to wing it through this. Um, members of council, Mr. Uh, Mayor, Mr. City Manager, I want to thank you for this opportunity. Um, just to give you a brief overview, I want to introduce my parents. Uh, my dad, who you met here, is uh, Dan Corbett. Seated to his left is my mom, who you've already heard from. It's such a choice for me. <laughs> my wife, Sharon, in the back row, and my daughter, uh, Alexandria, here in the front row. I also do want to thank uh, retired Chief Dennis Reese. Um, when I came to, to apply here in 1999, I was a much skinnier, a little more hair than what I have now. Uh, police officer looking to better my career and to find a place to retire. And uh, after what seemed like an exceptional amount of time seated in front of his desk begging for a job, uh, Chief Reese took the opportunity to uh, invest some time into me and give me an opportunity here. Um, one of the things that I said to Chief Reese when I sat in front of him was, if you give me the opportunity to come here, I promise to you I will be the hardest working, most dedicated officer that this department has seen. And I think, uh, without exception, I think I have proven that I have held up my end of the deal and been, been very well you know, received here. It's been, it's been a great opportunity. So for that, I do thank uh, Chief Reese. Would not be uh, polite if I didn't at least thank uh, Chief Sobranski for having the uh, faith in me to uh, carry on the uh, mission that's, that's already been started. So. With that, I continue to uh, make my pledge to you folks to uh, continue the hard work and dedication that I've ex extended in the last 14 years that I've been here. So with that, I say thank you.